Hello students, welcome to my channel. In today's class, you will learn accounting equation. This accounting equation topic come under the chapter number 3. That is recording of transaction 1. Okay, this topic accounting equation come under the chapter number 3 that is recording of transaction 1. And this third chapter is very important because from this chapter 6 marks and 12 marks questions will be asked. So the first and second chapter was theory based chapter and the chapter number 3 is sums oriented means in this chapter you have to solve the accounting problems or accounting sums like preparing the accounting equations or passing the general entries and preparing the ledger accounts. So let's start the accounting equation. So accounting equation signifies that the assets of a business are always equal to the total of its liabilities and capital. So this accounting equation what it say that the assets of a business are always equal to the liabilities and capital of the organization or business. So what do you mean by assets? Assets are the economic resources of the business or anything which has a value to that business that things are called assets. So business assets and reading back up today, yaw dat bartave? Land, building, machine, cash, goods, etc. So these all are the examples of assets of a business. Capital. The amount invested by the owner is called capital. How do the business start my back and right? back after that. So a business in a owner in investment maadi dane that amount is called capital. Bandavada. Next is liabilities. So liabilities are the debt of a business. So business net is pay can re hana da wash katir to de in in saving sella maadi dane adan investment maadi dane business shuru maadi likhe but the baki uli da hana van no loans and advances he will take from the bank then whatever the goods or machines he has purchased that may he purchase on the basis of credit. So all these loans and advances credit purchases are called liabilities of the organization or the liabilities of the business and this accounting equation is the assets of a business are always equal to the liabilities and capital of the organization or capital of the business got the meaning of accounting equation so the equation is assets is equal to liabilities plus capital so assets are equal to the liabilities and capital of the organization and the short form of accounting equation is a is equal to l plus c that is a is assets l is liability and c is capital so as you know in financial statements what we have to prepare in financial statement First, we have to prepare the trading and profit and loss account and balance sheet. Yes. What is this balance sheet? It is a statement of assets and liabilities. So, in this balance sheet, what we record? We record the liabilities and assets of the organization. So, in left side, we will record the liabilities and capital of the business and right side we record the assets of the business so the business in any liabilities you will have for example capital loan taken from bank creditors advances taken from the 
financial institutions or loans taken from the financial institutions so all the liabilities we will record in the left side and here assets of the business like land building machinery cash etc and the total of these two sides should be equal and the total of the liability side and the total of the asset side should be equal then only this balance sheet is correct so both this side you have to get the same amount same balance that is it should get tally that is called balance sheet so the equation what it say that the assets of a business are always equal to the liabilities and capital of the business got this equation it's very important okay because on this basis only we have to prepare the accounts so from this equation we have made two more equations that is capital is equal to assets minus liabilities so to get the capital amount what we have to do from assets we have to minus the liabilities so the short form is c is equal to a minus l liability to get the liability what we have to do from assets we have to minus the capital amount and we'll get the liabilities l is equal to a minus c so these are the equation accounting equation so on the basis of this equation we will solve one problem write the so the question is write the accounting equation and find out the missing figure so such type of question may be asked that you have to write the accounting equation and have to find out the missing figure so the accounting equation is a is equal to l plus c then c is equal to a minus l l is equal to a minus c this is the accounting equation now we'll find out the missing figure in first one what they have given assets and liabilities and we have to calculate the capital so which equation you will take second one c is equal to a minus l so a is how much 2 25000 minus liabilities that is 135000 so how much you will get 90000 yes the capital amount is 90000 clear second one and this assets they have not given here liabilities and capital amount is there so for that which formula you will take first one a is equal to l plus c so the liability is 2 lakh 65000 plus capital amount is 75000 and the total is 3 lakh 40 1000 so the total of assets and uh, the total of liabilities and capital is 3 lakh 40000 this is the asset amount in third one assets and capital they have given and we have to find out the liability so take the third equation l is equal to a minus c A is four lakh thirty thousand minus capital amount is one lakh twenty five thousand, and you will get three lakh five thousand. So three lakh five thousand is the liability. And the last one, and this assets and liabilities. We have mentioned, and we have to calculate the capital. So we will take the second formula. That is, C is equal to 
a minus l as it is 56000 minus liability that is 9800 and you will get 46200 this is the capital amount God all of you how to calculate this and uh, get the missing figure. So this type of question will be asked for 5 marks in section E that is practical oriented question. So if you want to tally it or just cross check, we will take this first one. So the accounting equation what it say that the assets are always equal to the liabilities and capital of the business. So assets amount is how much in this first one? 2,25,000 correct and liabilities amount is 1,35,000 plus capital is just we have calculated that is 90,000. So assets will be the same 2,25,000 and total of these two 1,35,000 plus 90,000. How much you will get? 2,25,000. So both the side we have got the same figure. Assets is also 2,25,000 and the total of Liabilities and capital is 2,25,000. So the equation is assets are always equal to the liabilities and capital of the organization. Got all of you this equation? So in my next video, we will solve one more problem based on this equation. And for more such videos, please do like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you, Sudhi.